It seems the key is getting it more rigid. I almost bit myself again. <laughs> getting the horn lined up with the axis mm -hmm. there and the axis there so they're perfectly 90 out and then your motion is perfectly in line and you don't have the flopping slop and it won't fall loose suddenly because mm -hmm. you're not rely you're not rel you're no longer relying on the other axis pull it's it's just in the one it's axis just in the, one the, axis. the one plane yeah. yeah and then play with the tightness of this and you don't I don't think you'll need these swivels. You can go with the rigid because this is 90 degrees to this one, mm -hmm. and so it should be able to fully play in either direction. But that should take care of the looseness. Mm -hmm. So now it's really just a matter of just rigiding, like tightening everything up, really. Yep. And the other way we could do that is somehow remount the servo so that the horn was naturally in line and then you wouldn't need this little mm -hmm. arm bar coming out. I wonder if you could get away with a smaller servo. Like, 